Craftastrophe. Today we are going to make a peep flower. So I have these different peeps, um, they're marshmallow chicks, and I'm going to make flowers out of them. We're going to use styrofoam ball and some toothpicks and um, some kebabs as the, uh, the base for, for our flower that we're going to make. And first, we're going to use a mason jar. We're going to use this as our base. And then I'm going to dump some of these uh, glass rocks in here. So we're going to have our glass rocks as our bottom piece here. And then we're going to add some of this, um, this in here. So I actually suggest pulling some of these out and make it a mixture so you have some on the bottom and then you're gonna have some of the sand in here just like that and then kind of like mix it up a little bit so you see your rocks in there see the sand put some more rocks in there and then we're gonna put some more rocks in here finish those off Okay, so we have our base of our um, of our little flower base for our peeps, and since peeps are little chicks, this represents the water, meaning that the the chicks are floating on the water. And we have our little balls here. We're gonna do a couple um, a couple different ones. Okay, so we separate the the chicks from each other because they're uh, stuck together here. So we separate them, and then we stick the toothpick in them and then we're going to put this on here I'm gonna go all the way in as far as we can go without smushing them okay and put them down like that and then move on to the next one and I suggest separating all these all at one time so you can put them all in together we are going to stick our next one in here We're gonna put our little chick on it, just like that. So we got two chicks. So we're gonna just keep going all the way around and have our chicks going on here. Just like that. We got three chicks. We got total of 10 chicks per box so you can do as many chicks as you want in your little flower you're gonna make and I find it easier to put the um, toothpick in the styrofoam first and then stick your chick in there and then you can just kind of squish them down move them around if you need to just keep doing this until we're done And then when you have your flower of peeps ready, just take your little kebab here. And then press it inward into your styrofoam. And then you can stick it in here and see where you want, how big you want it to be. You can have it smaller or bigger, and I'm gonna make it smaller so that it'll stay in there. So you're gonna rip that off. So, and then we're gonna stick this in here. And so we have one of our flowers of peeps, and now we're going to work on our second one. Do the same thing with this one and just pull them out. Grab your new ball, put your sticks on there and put 
punch them in. Just like that, put them next to each other, space them out however you want. And here we have the beginning of our second flower of chicks. And there's your second chick flower. So just like on the other one, just throw that in there. Make sure it sticks. And cut off the excess part that you don't want on your stick. Um, with the second one here, we basically did the same thing that we did with the first one, and we cut this off here, and then we put this in here like so. And you can always do a third one. I do have um, the pink one so that I could add a third ball and uh, do a third one so it makes it a bigger bouquet. And so that is how to make a peep bouquet of marshmallow candies into a flower, into a flower vase and make it look pretty. So thanks for watching and I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and please comment below and let me know if there's any new videos that you think I should do of crafts and uh, like and subscribe and thanks for watching and see you next time.